What is going on YouTube? Just helping you out here. And I just want to let you guys know I was requested to do uh, electricity and magnetism problems. And I was really happy to receive this request because I want my channel to be based off of you guys. What you guys want to see, unboxings, reviews, problems in a textbook, just or you could just send me stuff to do. I don't really care as long as I'm helping you guys out. I could even post, you know, a vlog here and there just to if it's entertaining, you know. So, chapter 21 uh, is about electric charge. This is in the Fundamentals of Physics 8th edition textbook by Drill Walker, Halliday, and Resnick. And electric charge is actually really similar to gravitation. I'll show you how in this problem. But this particular problem gives us two point charges and we're given the force between them and it wants to know how far away they are given those quantities so the very first equation in electric in electricity is the force between two point charges is k q1 q2 so q is your charge over d squared and k is actually simplified here k is normally 1 over 4 pi epsilon sub zero but we can just write it as k because it's simpler and one over four pi times epsilon zero is actually a constant because pi we know is 3.14 and epsilon sub zero is like 8.85 times 10 to the uh, negative 12th so that right there is just a constant we can write as k and so we're asked to find the distance between them. So what we need to do is rearrange this equation to solve for d. So we can write this again as d squared equals k q1 q2 over f. And then we can simplify that again by square rooting both sides. And that'll give us d equals the square root of k q1 q2 over f. And let's substitute in those values. So K, when you uh, put everything together, is 8.99 times 10 to the 9th. Our first charge is 26 microcoulombs. So we're going to do 26 times 10 to the negative 6. Whenever you see micro or the symbol mu, which means micro, it's going to be times 10 to the negative sixth, so whatever value it is. And our last one is negative 47 microcoulombs, so we'll write negative 47 times 10 to the negative sixth. And that's all over our force, which we are given to be 5.7 newtons. And when you plug that into your calculators, you should get a distance of 1.39 meters. Okay? And the reason why this is similar to gravitation is because our fundamental equation for that is the force of gravity is equal to g mass 1 mass 2 over r squared, radius being the radius between one object and another object. And as you can see here, this is pretty similar to what we have here because k is a constant and g is a constant the two things that are attracting each other is the charges here versus the masses here and the distance between them versus the radius between them so you can see that they're pretty similar and you'll notice within the chapter that and other chapters that they are very similar to each other okay so that's how you do problem one in chapter 21 if you found this video helpful please drop a like Leave a comment if you have an idea for a future video or a question about something I did. And lastly, please don't forget to subscribe and tell people about me, and I'll be able to grow and I'll be able to post more often. I'm just helping you out. See you in the next video.